Okay. Okay. <laughs> you ready to go? Ron, what are you doing here? Oh, why wait any longer to spend the night out at the town with the most prettiest girl in the world? Oh, uh, why don't you come in? I had no idea you'd be this early, so I'm not quite ready. Oh, I almost forgot. Dave is stopping by around 8. He said he really wanted to talk to you. Michelle, you know I hate him. How can you invite him over here? Maybe because I'm tired of seeing you two fight every time you cross paths. It's time you forget the past and try to be friends. Michelle, you know I would do anything for you, but this is asking too much. I'd rather just kill the guy and then breathe the same air that he breathes. You don't understand how much he humiliated me in front of all my, all my friends. Now you just expect me to forget that and, and pretend it never happened? Ron, what you did was wrong. You almost killed someone and yet you're more concerned about your reputation. You need to grow up and take some responsibility. When that girl had blood all over her dress, I honestly thought you killed her. I wish there was something I could do to erase that memory from your mind. Maybe if I sliced here and there, it, it, it could just cut out all those memories. You need to seriously stop watching those late night slasher films. Take a deep breath and just chill. If you don't want Dave here, I'm not going to force you to see him. It was just a thought. Huh? What about our date? You know, I don't feel like I'm in the mood anymore. Dave was right. You do need to have your head examined. Alright. I'm in the mood. When? Now. Just give me a minute. I need to pick out some shoes to go with this dress. I'm not waiting. Okay, well, give me a second to send Dave a text to let him know we won't be here. Michelle, there's no we. I'm going, and you're staying here. Huh? Ron? Slate? You're just standing in the center of you. Kevin Craig Wesley with Grossman and Jack Talent.